NextCloud is an open source, self-hosted file storage and sync platform. Let's set up the product in your AWS account. You can find the link for the developer guide under the resources section of the product page. If you have fulfilled all the prerequisites, you can continue to set up the product. To begin with, click the View Purchase Options button. After subscribing, you will need to accept the terms and conditions. Click on Accept Terms to proceed. Please wait for a few minutes while the processing takes place. Once it's completed, click on Continue to Configuration. Select CloudFormation Script to deploy next cloud option. Choose the version and your preferred region. Afterward, click the Continue to Launch button. From the Choose Action drop down menu, select Launch CloudFormation and click Launch button. Now we can create CloudFormation stack. Click Next. Provide a unique stack name. Provide the admin email for SSL generation. For deployment name, enter a name of your choice. Provide a public domain name for domain name. Choose an instance type. Recommended is t3a.small. Select your preferred key name. Set SSH location as 0.0.0.0/0. Keep subnet CIDR block as 10.0.0.0/24. Keep VPC CIDR block as 10.0.0.0/16. Click Next. Now we can configure stack options. Click Next. Review and verify the details you've entered. Tick the box that says. I acknowledge that a WS CloudFormation might create IAM resources with custom names. Click Submit. Afterward, you'll be directed to the CloudFormation Stacks page. Please wait for 5 to 10 minutes until the stack has been successfully created. Fast forwarding 5 to 10 minutes. After CloudFormation is created, we can update DNS. Copy the public IP labeled public IP in the outputs tab. Go to a WS Route 53 and navigate to Hosted Zones. Select the correct Hosted Zone. From there, click on Create Record and paste the copied public IP address into the value text box. Enter the domain name. And click Create Record. Click on the URL of the initial setup URL domain. Click Advanced and proceed to the domain. Please save the passphrase. Click on Open Nextcloud IO Login. Enter the passphrase and click Login. You will be directed to the initial setup page. Please enter your domain name in the text box and click Submit Domain. You can install several optional applications along with the next cloud like Calabra, Clem AV, Imaginary. Click on Download and Start Containers button. Wait for several minutes and if the loading screen is still there, Reload the page. Fast forwarding 3 to 5 minutes. Save the login details. Then click on Open Your Next Cloud button. You can see the SSL certificate has installed. Log into the Next Cloud dashboard using the saved credentials. Congratulations, you have successfully logged into the Next Cloud dashboard. Next time when you need to log into the dashboard, you can just use the domain name. 
You can also find this in the Output tab of the CloudFormation Stack page. Use the previously saved credentials to log in. Let's access the setup interface. Click on the profile icon and go to Administration Settings. Then click on Open Next Cloud AIO Interface. Let's create a backup. Enter the location where you want to store the backup in your server. Click on Submit Backup Location. Next, click on Create Backup button. Note that all the containers will be stopped until the backup process is completed. Wait for several minutes. Click on Reload button if it appears. Let's check the backup. Open the terminal and copy the IP address from Stacks page. Go to the directory where your private key is located. Paste the following command into your terminal and press enter. ssh-i your key name, Ubuntu at public IP address. Type yes and press enter. This will log you into the server. Go to the backup location and check. After the successful backup process, you need to manually turn on the containers by pressing Start Containers button. If you want to change the optional containers, first click on Stop Containers button. Let's untick the imaginary container. Remember to save changes. Then click on Start Containers. Enjoy Next Cloud.